Right, um, let's try and get this video right. I've been doing it several times and I think this is going to be the last time I'm doing it. So, what I've put together is three crystals which can help you either with diabetes or wanting to recover and maintain your energy through the day. So, we have the famous Numite, which is really good for maintaining energy. Uh, well, not maintaining, recovering from energy. Um, so you've got that that crystal there, which you're all very uh, familiar with. So that's also very good for keeping your energy clear through the day. So you've got the new light there, which which obviously reflects someone's energy and absorbs negative energy. And what I did also is added a Herkimer diamond on there, so it can keep these two crystals clear. So also it keeps your your mind clear and focused and that which I could have done with before <laughs> yeah and also the garnet which is the bottom which helps to maintain energy so if you keep this this crystal fairly high up so around your heart area which will help you to maintain that energy around that area um, yeah and also this crystal is very good f both this crystal and the new might are very very good for um, people that are suffering from or or have you know, the symptoms of um, diabetes so both garnet and Numa are very beneficial to for people suffering with garnet uh, with garnet <laughs> with diabetes sorry I'd look at the garnet now. so those two crystals are really good for uh, for diabetics anyway so yeah so those crystals are really good and amplification which helps those crystals. Also, the the new might is very good for people that you know or very f faint hard, not faint hard, but that's the wrong word. People that um, tend to get dizzy, dizziness, or anything to do with the ears, uh, which causes dizziness and faint and uh, low blood sugar as well. If you're suffering from uh, both these two crystals are really good for you know, garnet and the new are really good for low pr blood pressure. I can never say blood pressure properly, but anyway, they're good, really good for maintaining that uh, that blood pressure as well. And also, a good crystal for maintaining blood pressure is um, the uh, lava kite, which I talked about. I think it was one of my first videos I ever did. So, really good for maintaining. Oh, and also, the garnet is a very good one for. Um, uh, purifying the blood so also the garnet is very good for that so these two crystals are very good paired up with each other because they have some great capabilities to clear uh, the blood of any toxins and stuff like that so really good crystal so I think this is a great trio for anyone wanting to maintain energy keep your energy clear just clear cut clear clear quartz well you could use clear quartz but um hook of diamonds are much more faster working and more powerful a crystal than normal quartz so yeah so these three crystals would work together in harmony so helping to both the well the herkimer diamond would actually help to clear the new might and the garnet of um, any built-up energies but um, garnet doesn't tend to hold um, energy that much. I think it transmutes, so it doesn't really hold. But it's nice to have it there just to keep it fresh and clear anyway, which I wanted to do anyway. Um, I also got my. There's also a little bit of the top there. There's a um, uh, what do you call it? Um, trying to think of the name. I can't remember what it's called. Pyrite. There we go. But, but if you don't if you can see on this also to show you as well on this little video, um I've got a little window. I don't know if you can see it. Just there. I'll zoom in. Turn the flash off a minute. I hope you're not be able to see it. But there is it's a little bit fuzzy now. But if you can see the red dot, I'll turn the light back on. There, there's a little window. So, what to show you the first time? 
it's almost like that, that flash there is showing you where it is. And in that, that piece there, it's really hard to show you. It would be nice if the sun was out, but you can see the red. It's like a what they call phantom quartz, which is in the new Mike Stone. I've never been able to show the, the uh, I did some more cleaning up on this crystal just to make it more smooth line. So I um, polished, repolished it, and also got this really my screen band going past. <laughs> I also got this really big um, showed up this really big flash on the back of it, and it's really quite spectacular. And also on the back, I always like this bit on the side, whereas at this side, the, the what I call the helping hand, it's almost like the this bit here, I call it the healer's hand, or the helping hand. I've actually got a crystal upstairs which I do want to show you, and I call it the, uh, the broken heart crystal. It's actually a Himalayan quartz, but it looks like a broken heart, like, you know, like the... Uh, not the physical heart, but you know, the heart which most people draw, it's like half of that, so I will show you that one day. And also I will be doing a another video on Herkimer Diamond as well, so giving a bit more insights to that and how it can help. I have done a video on it, but I want to do another video uh, a bit more in depth into Herkimer Diamond. But yeah, so these three crystals, getting back to what I'm talking about, these three crystals, really good for <clears throat> maintaining which you get with the garnet and clear quartz which can help clear any energies for the day and then the garnet which you can use for um, uh, recovery, uh, purification, uh, regeneration so really great crystals for that so yeah I hope you like the little video I've done I finally got the information I wanted to get across and finally got what I wanted to say across. So I anyway, I hope you like the little video I've done. And stay not stay tuned, but <laughs> stay um well, just keep looking out for my next video on what garnet not garnet, sorry, wrong wrong crystal. On Herkimer Diamond, which I'll do most likely tomorrow. Alright, thank you very much then for watching. Bye.